All right, I got my Czechoslovakian CZ52 here again. <clears throat> Let's get a good look at it. Shot some uh, target earlier. I'm gonna got some watermelon that have been stinking up my truck for a couple weeks. Waiting for this thing to come in, so I uh, decided I'm gonna shoot them, get rid of them, destroy them for stinking up my Buick. So, at any rate, it's got a. Uh, mine's got the aftermarket. Uh, slide release lever this piece here usually they just have the bar that goes under the grip <clears throat> so somebody put this on at some point <clears throat> and it's got the safety right here push up I'll push it up there safety I don't know if you can see it. it's kind of dark on the screen here yep this one's in pretty nice shape uh, I was very happy with it because a lot of them I was looking at were pretty rough the finishes were pretty bad the grips were questionable uh, this one's in really nice shape so i was pretty lucky and i got it for a good price a lot of them this going for this bit of condition are going for three four hundred dollars i paid like 225 for this one so i was very happy with it so at any rate shoots the uh 7.62 by 25 toker off round which is a pretty fast round they claim like 1600 feet per second um, probably a little slower out of the handgun pistol so it's made by this this one's ppu or privy partisan makes it for uh wolf so and i got the hollow points obviously i don't know if i you guys saw that but uh that's what i'm shooting today that's my pile of stinky watermelons which must be destroyed. Stinking all week. Alright. Let's give her a try. shoot anything that close to the ground I better make sure the camera's actually picking it up yep sometimes I shoot a couple feet higher didn't want to go through all the trouble of filming it and have it not even show the watermelon uh, it's a single stack magazine I've read online it's eight round magazine I'm not I didn't get no instructions or nothing with it so I just going by that I Loaded up eight last time, felt pretty good, so I didn't try it anymore. Eight's good enough for me. So. I help if I count. Looks like we got eight. few more I'll probably just finish this box off I've maybe got 20 or so left yeah, I don't know if I had said this in this video but uh, I was basically looking for a a newer gun that shot the, the 7.62 by 25 Tokarov ammo. Um, I got a Yugoslavian M57. And I just basically wanted a newer version, something newer that shot this round. So that's why I started looking, looking at the CZ52. So I, I really like it. It's a nice looking gun. 
uh, I mean, it's, it shoots nice. Empty again. I got the door closed on the car. Last time I shot watermelon, I ended up having freaking digging chunks out of the front of the windshield. It went all the way through the back, all the way up inside the, the SUV into the uh, lodged up watermelon up against the front window. Yeah, not cool. I think I, I parked farther away this time and I closed the back door, I hope. Yeah, it looks like I did. All right, got number eight. How am I aim for the target this time? Uh, the right lung I haven't shot up yet, so I'll try shooting that a little bit. Oh, chamber one? Oh, it's got a chamber one. That would help. Looks like I got a couple more. I figured I got an oddball, two rounds left. Uh, let's load them up quick and fire them too. Yep. Looks like we're good to go. Alright. Let's see how we did. Well, watermelon are all destroyed. Oh, God. Stinky ass things. Yeah, looks like we. Can't hurt to see all the dirt there. Looks like we got the lung too. That's what I was aiming for. So, yeah, pretty accurate. Pretty nice gun. So, back and show it one last time before I let you guys go. Uh, I definitely recommend if you can find one in really good shape. I definitely get one. These are uh, not that easy to find. I mean, there's a few on the gun auction ones, but you really, uh, if you find one in good quality, I definitely, definitely get one. So, very nice. Well, that's it, guys.